To our continuing coverage tonight, we turn now to 18 News reporter Daryl Matthews. He's live in the studio. Daryl. Thank you, Zach. 18 years ago today, hundreds of first responders lost their lives in the 9 11 attacks. Today, a community honored local first responders, especially the men and women who have taken part in one of the most tragic days in U.S. history. This morning, the Painted Post Memorial Service is where people gathered in unity. Veterans marched today in honor of 9 11, and various people were there, including Phil Paul Masano, who spoke to honor the first responders. A simple thank you because these first front responders never have and they never will hesitate to lay down their life to protect you, our families, and our freedom. Now, this is one of many memorials that took place today in the Twin Tiers to pay homage to the community and the community continues to say thank you far and wide. Now at the Mansfield Veteran Park, people also gathered for a remembrance ceremony of September 11th. The North Penn Mansfield High School Marching Band honored the ceremony with patriotic songs that brought the crowd together. Other participants, including the Mansfield University Municipal Police Cadets, assisted in the ceremony, and the event was sponsored by the American Legion. It's an important part of our American history, and it's a sad part, and it's something that uh, we need to remember and, and salute all the people who, who died and all the people who responded who also subsequently died. My cousin's husband retired as a lieutenant in the Pennsylvania State Police. He was in charge of the barracks at Washington, and he was assigned to be head of the security at Shanksville when 9-11 happened. It, it brings it home how much we all are involved and how much we all need to remember. Now the Manfields Park has hosted the remembrance ceremony every year since 2002 and plan to continue. The ceremony was a great tribute for those who lost their lives 18 years ago.